wonderful tradition for so many families, and this weekend you get to be a part of it. ABC 15's Chelsea Davis, she joins us live from Food City in Phoenix this morning. Chelsea, there is so much more to this event than just eating and having fun, right? Oh, definitely. I mean, eating and having fun is probably the priority, but of course, the 16th Annual Tamale Festival is happening this weekend downtown Phoenix at Cesar Chavez Plaza, but this morning, we're at Food City because we got to show you some of these delicious tamales. So if Iris doesn't bring them for you guys, Dan and Danielle, I'm going to try to bring them for you, but Susie Farah is here. So talk about kind of the history of tamales, why it's important. Good morning. Yes, indeed. Uh, the actual history of tamales goes way back like 5,000 years BC. Yeah. And um, it was based on actually wives going with the army troops to create the masa from the corn and actually use every bit of the corn when it came from the actual uh, kernels mm -hmm. to the corn husk to make that masa and uh, be able to spread it on the corn husk and make these tamales. Yeah. Nowadays, it's, it's a Latin culture that we have during the holidays that families get together to actually create the tamales for Christmas. Yes. We are all, I mean, even this, the Spindle family, I'm sure, is looking forward to getting some of these tamales, and I'm going to try to bring some back for you guys. But, Susie, we, we have to talk about some of the traditional flavors first. So we've got the red chili, the green chili. What else? There's other meat ones. There is so many flavors, and the most traditional is the corn husk wrap, but believe it or not, there's also the banana leaf wrap. Um, it all depends of what type of, of which country and which area you are from, but yet the most traditional, of course, is the red chili either if it's red chili green um, beef or pork and then the, we've got green chili chicken yes. there's also the the chili cheese which is the green chili with the cheese and it's all based on the masa on the corn as well i love it so coming up next hit guys we're going to be showing you some of the sweet treats here and we're not talking cupcakes oh no we're talking sweet flavored tamales it's going to be so much fun and we'll have more info about the event and the best part guys it's free oh even better how are we going to make it through another hour and 20 minutes? I don't know. Chelsea might tamales. have to make a stop here and then go back. Yep. We might have to do that. I don't know.